How are you doing guys and you are welcome back to another video. Now today um, we do have a video, up, we do have a special airport update because it's been over a year since I've actually done this airport. It is St. Mary's Airport um, and we also do have a new terminal in today's update as well to replace the other ter one terminal and I also have a bit of news for you at the end as well so <coughs> sorry but cough let's get right into it so we do have the air traffic control we have a hangar here we have the runway so as the, we'll do the same as last video we'll start off with the departing planes so getting ready to taxi down and um, for departure is air is air canada um and that is heading off to i know it's a big plane but it's heading off to toronto and then we do have air new zealand and that is heading off to um um i think sydney now i know this is a bit crazy now I can't remember who actually got me this plane, but someone that was in America got me this US Airways tiny L plane. I'm just using it here. Um, I'm not really, I'm just using it here just for this video. Um, um, so yeah, um, so, um, so that is heading off to Chicago. <coughs> and then we do have an, an Italian. Now I'm just pretending it is a United Airlines ATR if they have any yours. I think they do. Um, and then lining up with the runway, we do have Norwegian, and that is heading off to Oslo. And then um, over here as well, um, we do have Air Canada Rouge, and that is coming in from Toronto. And then over here, then we do the Swiss Air, it's just left the runway, and that is heading for Geneva. And then we do have the control tower and the hangar here as well. And then, um, but, so this is our new terminal. It goes all the way up there. And then we have this terminal, and that, that terminal used to be over where they were. Um, so, uh, yeah, um, so, yeah, um, so, um, we get started at this terminal. So, as you can see, we do have a jet blue, and that is getting ready to depart to Boston. Um, <coughs> and then we do also uh, Russia, I'm pretending it's a big plane, heading to Moscow. We do have Southwest, that's heading to St. Louis. And then we do have um, North American Airlines that is heading for, uh, I think, I think it's Toronto and then on to somewhere in North America, but I'm actually not very sure where it is. And then we do have um, in, um, Air India um, that is heading out for New Delhi. And then we do have Jetstar that's heading for Beijing. And then very close to Jester, um, we do have Alaska, and I'm not sure whereabouts in Alaska, that's heading for either. Uh, and then we do have the Qantas, the animals delivery, um, and pretend it's a big plane, and that is heading for Melbourne. And then uh, we do have Turkish, then we do have Turkish Airlines, and that is heading for Istanbul. Um... And then we, that's um. So uh, just to let you know, here is terminal one. This here is terminal two, and that's three over there. So as you can see, that's the Qantas that's heading to Melbourne. And then we do have Turkish Airlines that's heading for Istanbul. And then we do have British Airways that is heading for uh, Heathrow. Um, and then we do have American Airlines that is heading for uh, John F. Kennedy's airport, JFK. Then we do have KLM and that is heading for Schiphol. And then we do have a Delta here getting pushed back and that is heading for Atlanta, Georgia. And then we also do have Thompson, I know it's Brittany, but um, Thompson Airways and that is heading for, um, I think it's heading for, um, 
this is in U root and all, um, but I'm just pretending U root. It's from say it's from here to St. Mar from Manchester to St. Martins, St. Martins to here, and then from here to St. Martins and then to Manchester. And then we do Iberia, that just came in from Barcelona and we'll be departing there. And then we do have Pia, Paya, that came in from somewhere in Pakistan. I'm not actually 100% sure where. And then we do have Aer Lingus, that is just came in from um, from um, from Dublin. And then we do have another Aer Lingus that is heading for Shannon. The second one over there. And then we do have China Airlines, and that has just came in from um, Hong Kong, and we'll be departing there. And then we do have Emirates, <coughs> that just came in from Dubai. <coughs> and we'll be departing there. We do have Quad Airways uh, heading for Doha. And then we do have SAS uh, heading for Stockholm. And Virgin Atlantic heading for Gatwick. And then we also have um, the this terminal tree. So we do have a massive China Southern plane, and that is heading off to um, to Beijing or Hong Kong. Sorry. And then we do have a Malaysian Airlines that is heading for Kuala Lumpur. And this one came in from Kuala Lumpur. We do have Lufthansa, um, that's heading for um, Frankfurt. These are all a creations on Terminal 3 here. And then we do British Airways and that is heading out for um, for Heathrow. We do have, I'm just pretending it's it's a um, it's an Air France a creation. I know it's Fly Espana and that is heading for Charles de Gaulle. And then we do have Singapore Airlines and that is heading for Singapore, of course. So, um, the news about this airport is, this airport is handling an awful lot of traffic these days and is having um, a lot of problems putting up with this traffic. So, to solve that problem, we are going to be building another runway all the way up to here. Um, and, um, that's our plan anyways our another plan is to build one up where this kind of mess is here um but um i think uh, it'll be along here um and that this taxiway here will have access to both runways like like america west airport because this airport is just jammed pack packed with planes and it needs another runway because we're getting a few new routes here as well and a few new airlines as well and um, such as Lash are going to be launching routes here from more from more so as well and um, we're going to have West Jet flying here soon as well and uh, we just need we need more and hopefully a proper US Airways <coughs> so we just need another runway to just accommodate this traffic and um, another terminal probably as well. So um, the airport for now um, is just going to have to deal with it, but soon enough in the future, in the next month or so, we will start building this runway. Um, if you are wondering how we're going to create a road up here to this building through the hangar, we're going to have to create an underground road that will connect right under the two, the taxiway down to this runway here. Here and um, yeah, so um, yeah, and so I hope you enjoyed the uh, the video, and uh, we look forward to seeing you soon, and uh, see you in the next video. Bye.